offensively in the second half. Marcus went out, sprained his ankle early in the third quarter. Uh, we didn't have much of a running game, and, uh, but they stayed on the field most of the half. When we were we had to punt. When we had to punt a lot, it uh, didn't work out very well. Uh, defensively, we had a lot of great plays on first and second down, but third down, I don't know how many they made, but just about all of them in the second half, I guess, until they made the fourth one. Uh, but anyway, that's, that's what happens when, in close games. Uh, we got a defensive guy, made, made a missed assignment. Uh, we, we're trying to hang on the corner of the end zone. We had one-on-one -on -one, uh, with our receiver, and Stephen just it, it didn't come out of his hand very well, and he got it inside instead of an outside corner. And uh, <laughs> they came by and got the ricochet pick, just like uh, the last three weeks. We've had a, a ricochet off a guy uh, to the defense. And, uh, yeah, we were in field goal range. I knew that. I thought it was worth a shot to run a little man-to-man -to, -man, uh, to the back of the end zone over there, but we, we didn't get the ball there. So it was a bad call. But give uh, Kentucky credit. Uh, they kicked, kicked our tails second half, and uh, they played a lot better than we did. Steve, are you watching the final call? Why the ball should go to Alshon? Uh, well, I think if Alshon had been there, the safety had been over him. But uh, uh, the safeties were hanging sort of over, uh, sort of a 2 deep, but they were way inside. So it was a chance to throw one up to another receiver. No, I don't think uh, they would play that coverage with him out there. Did you guys ever consider going to Kate Miles in the second half? Uh, yeah, I don't think it would have been a factor, although uh, we probably should have. But uh, we'd, uh, we we couldn't run very well at all. They, they, they stuffed us pretty good. Give Kentucky credit. We didn't, we didn't block very well all day, most of Marcus's runs. I think he broke one or two tackles, and away he'd go. Uh, so obviously, uh, obviously uh, it was a tale of two halves for our offense. Do you know yet how seriously Marcus is hurt? He just a sprained ankle is what uh, they, they said, just a sprained ankle. So he may be out a week or two. Just have to wait and see. Did he ask to come back? Did he try to come back? No, nah, he, couldn't, he couldn't run on it. Yeah, he was hurt. Steve, their receivers, they were running pretty wide open. Yeah, yeah. We, uh, I don't know. You'll have to ask uh, Coach uh, Johnson and Coach Ward. We, we felt like uh, we needed to zone them up, I guess. And uh, they, they picked us on, on the third downs. Yeah, it was it – was, we play so well on first and second, and then here come third, and then and finally here come fourth. But yeah, we had so many good plays, uh, but you got to play them all, as we know. You got to play the entire game. We didn't do it as a team tonight. And uh, Lanning Spencer punted beautifully. We got out of some jams. Their kid punted beautifully too, and uh, had a chance to. We didn't get a turnover. Did we? No, we had a chance on the fumble punt, but um, we can't. We can't get them. We don't get them, and it came back to haunt do you think your guys had an emotional letdown? In the no, no, we were ready for it. No, I, I, not that I know of. Marcus started the second half and got hurt. And, uh, they, they schemed us up all oh, that same way, I think. I don't know how differently. Uh, we just we had to pump. We messed up. We messed up. We had a third and third and five. And Stephen threw the deep one toward the little ace, and you know we were trying to throw a little under guy there, but then, then we punted down the two yard line. And, that was the right play, I thought, at 28 to 10. And they went 98 yards, I guess, 97 yards. And they must have made three or four third downs in that. So, you know, our third down uh, defense has really not been very good this year, as, as you all know. And that's, that's what's hurt us. Guys played uh, very well, uh, except on the, on the thirds and, and then the fourth had a, had a breakdown. Any reason in particular why Swear and Jones is returning? <clears throat> he's, he's pretty good at it. Yeah, but obviously, you know, sure. Bryce Sherman is very good also. Coach, so, Coach, can you describe the first half? You were almost yeah. let, letter perfect. You must have been yeah, I mean, we had a couple turnovers, though. And then, uh, you know, even right there in the first half, we were hoping to get some more points. But, yeah, you know, we, it is what it is. They, they moved the ball extremely well, and, uh, and we didn't the second half. And, and they made the third downs. We didn't make many at all. And then they made a fourth down, and they won the game. Overall, we, Steve, how do you yeah. think Steve? Oh, he was beautiful the first half. He had one of his great, you know, statistically his best game ever. And he played okay. Yeah, I think he played okay. There wasn't much out there. Uh, you guys watched it. They, they, they kicked our tails in the second half, and they, they made all the third downs. And uh, we got to play, play better on third downs.
the, the way this played out, do you anticipate you guys might have a hard time bouncing No, we'll be, we'll be, we're still in the hunt. Now, if we fall on our face or get beat again, we won't be in the hunt. But uh, the Eastern Division is a little down this year, so we're still in the hunt. We're still in the hunt. we got a couple of teams, Andy in Tennessee. We may be favored again. I don't know. But uh, I thought we played a lot better tonight. But uh, hey, we, we didn't. Is, is this game kind of a, a testament of how hard it is to go on the road in the SEC oh, after yeah. a big home, oh, after big home win? Yeah, we, we, we just can't, as they say, put the nail in the coffin. We, we, can't, we can't put a team away. And uh, just can't do it. I don't know why, but just can't do it. So we had numerous chances there to put them away take over the game defensively or offensively here or there, and uh, we just can't do it. So we were in a dog fight, and they hit a fourth down play, and our ball got picked off in the end zone, and that's the way it happened. Is it frustrating? But I mean, we didn't get any turnovers all night, and uh, we gave up a few. But, I mean, we just, we, <clears throat> man, you know, it, you just can't win all the time without making some plays on special team, making a turnover, you know, or something, get a field position, this, that, and the other. So it was, uh, we were back in the hole, and uh, we didn't play very well on offense. And the other team just beat us, that's all I can say. Is it frustrating mm -hmm. put Alabama away last week and now you can't? Well, we back. played near perfect last week, near perfect. And uh, yeah, we were playing the first half pretty well, but uh, it just, uh, we'll have to watch the tape, see how it happened. But uh, we couldn't run the ball very well. So give Kentucky credit there. Okay, all right, see you guys.